to tell you a story. First thing you have to understand, though, time doesn't work the way you think it does. You can call me Oracle. Specifically for this one, because of the kind of story that I'm telling you. I'm going to tell you the story of Deep Mystery. For anyone who remembers that I, or has seen the video where I mentioned that I used to play a character named Dr. Mystery, that is extra hilarious. This is about the journey of the fool. The journey of the fool covers the entirety of the major arcana. But it always starts at Zonya. At zero. With Nirbudi, Muka. Oh, Nirbudi, Murka, the fool. Here's the thing about the fool's journey. Anyone familiar with full metal alchemist? Especially Brotherhood. Is familiar with the core concept of the search for immortality. That's essentially what the fool's journey is about. Because the fool's journey is about Balama Na Titi. Or the fool's manner of dying errand. Where it's, someone is sent as a um, Amrta Yaja. A sacrifice for immortality by the local king who is dying. And basically he has this dude who he knows to be mentally pure. Or Manaputa. And because he's Manaputa, it's like... Well, man, if anyone, I'm corrupt as heck, but if anyone can find immortality for me, it's this mentally pure guy I got. And so, because he had a capacity to begin, or arabate, to live freely, Giovati moksha, and to roam hither and thither, or atati pura ka thither, or atati pura ka tad, he was tasked by the king to Margayati Amritata, or to seek for immortality. And so he, being, everyone thought this dude was stupid, because he was the, noted as being the fool. But he did have the capacity to satati, or to mentally resolve to make decisions. So he's like, okay, there are a lot of legends about immortality. If I actually am going to do this, here's the ways I can do it. I can look for a friend or keeper of immortality, an Amritabandu, I can uh, try to retrieve the Nectar of Immortality, or Amartaka. Uh, I can try to find a child of Immortality, uh, Amartagarva, and find out how to become immortal from them, because um, this is just, like, this is Oracle making a, a bit of a guess on this. I'm pretty sure that's something that was, like, part of the job, more or less, of a child of Immortality. And uh, I can try to discover the sound of Immortality, Amartan Athadonisad, and then reproduce it for the king. Um, or I can try to find a way to locate uh, Amartyaja, the world of immortality, and then guide the king there. And basically, the, he presented these. Uh, basically, the king asked the fool, he asked all of it, he asked everyone, everyone, everyone has asked, How do I become immortal? I need to become immortal because I'm, I'm, I'm dying. And generally speaking, people were like, you're the king. We'll tell you what we know. But um, when he came to the fool, the fool was like, all right, these are my ideas. And the king goes, all right, go go, go do them. And the, and the fool goes, um, oh, well, okay, you're the king, so I don't want to be beheaded, so I'm not that dumb, so I'm going to go do that. I'm going to go begin my Balamana uh, Hiti. I'm going to go start my fool's, my fool's errand or my uh, fool's manner of dying errand. All right, so now that I've given you that, we're going to move on to the readings of that. And then we'll be starting in the Vero Begins. We have a new prologue for a story to begin. Oh, the story of the Sangeeta, of the way of singing, winging, of the way they of the fool, folly, maniacs, dragons, intoxication, delirium, frenzy, uh, bereavement, but not betrayment, bereavement, reverse, negligence, absence, distribution, carelessness, apathy, nullity, and vanity, for those are, or the things of the king that sent him on the uh, journey to die thereof, of, of, 
And that's the way it be, it be and they the ways I say. And then it moving, moving to the inverted tarot blaze away. And then we go the fool, the new beginning, a fresh start. First time you do something, open an ear for new things, spontaneous and carefree. Boundless potential, feeling like a uh, reverse meaning, feeling like a fool due to your inexperience, gullibility. Immature, impulsive, thrill seeking, irresponsible. Watch your step. <sighs> if you remember the card, it has him on a cliff's edge. Remember, watch your step. That's the way it be in the ways of eternity. That's the way to be in the journey's way to say. That's uh, if you uh, watched um, King of Pe like um, Court of uh, Pentacles. That's a very important reason why the king in that situation is the wayfarer because he's the one who went out and did the questing himself. He didn't. He didn't send like someone in his opinion disposable to go get the important thing for him. He went and got the important thing himself. Have you ever played um, Quest for Camelot? Um, it's an old Sierra game. Uh, basically, King Arthur has to go quest for the Holy Grail to restore Britain because of just how bad things have gotten there. And that's just like the core essence of the story. Like, yeah, it involved him leaving his his like kingdom, which normally would be incredibly negligent. But by the same token, he also had gone over there to look after things. And um, it was something to literally like restore the kingdom. It's like in like a much like an actual grandiose sense like the small things like i would do when i used to be a manager for a gas station like when i would like go to like the staples and like get you know, the holy grail of 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 um of uh something to to spray in the bathroom because people used to like exclusively go there to use the bathroom and tell us that we suck and then leave <laughs> like that's just kind of the nature thing but um as he went to uh, venture all around Chalita, where you go around, around, all of the place in the world still swound. Woo! So, and that be the beginning of the story of the fool. Oh, there's one more. That's right. And it's so old. Oh, where, where is it? All right. Uh, um, apparently I put down my put down my last one somewhere I can't find it so I'm gonna go uh, find the booklet for the uh, the rest of the uh, the major arcana and uh, I might start moving the uh, the camera for the, the rest of this we'll see but um for now it's all crystal finishing up on my zapathamoni I'll zapatum karoti I'll finish this story sanghita balamanahiti but uh, I'm not going to go questing for uh, immortality for any of you. Unless you're one of the people I really like. I might do it for you. But like, otherwise, I'll just do the Sangeetas or Zakuna Abi, Zakuna Sangeeta story for thee. Hope you're, hope you're actually watching the, the beginning of all of this. Because if you jump in at this point, um, there's quite a lot that I'm probably going to reference that you just won't understand. Anyway, because that's actually a very important thing about the tarot. Major Arcana. The trumps are the trumps are the most important Krita Patra if you're doing it. If you're playing tarot as a as a Krita, as a game, well the trumps are the most important Krita Patra. But you need the other ones for the trumps to matter. That's why Chalita has four parts of the song. Cause there are four suits in the creed of Patras all along. Every creed usually has plays too. They come and they can then become Trini and Kator sometimes in the way they are. But that's the way of Bondu, the family ways. I'll talk to you later in the true day. Satya, Dina, let it be. In the way of Avati Sayyidina true weed. And that'll be later, I'll be talking to you. This will be Sakuna Sangita Oracle for you. And that'll be later in the time of the week. Have a good evening, day or day. Or the Dakti as they would us say. And that'll be later, talking to you. I'll be in a bitty mookie and I'll be away you. I'll be near Bodhi Merkabi, 
Never beauty and not a foolish one, joyful fool in the way of the wind. Talk to you later, it's all gonna be.